Okay, our News 8 Storm Team forecast calls for rain and drizzle this morning, damp and mild. The rain still could be heavy at times later this morning into the afternoon with periods of rain continuing this evening. So we still have that on again, off again effect with temperatures holding steady in the mid to upper 40s. Tonight, impacts continue, although rain will be ending before midnight. It's the flooding re residual concerns uh, that remain for us tonight into early tomorrow morning. So 38 to 42 tonight, some patchy fog, mostly cloudy skies. Tomorrow, it's a dry start, which is going to be a nice change of pace, but not dry all day. I still see some scattered showers possible after lunchtime into the afternoon, evening hours with breezy conditions. Winds out of the west northwest up to 15 miles per hour and highs tomorrow a little bit milder in the 50s. Right now, everybody's uniform in the 40s with clouds and rain coming down. It's a damp start to the day for sure. Real dreary out there because we have this easterly flow, which is actually a good thing. It's preventing us from getting any severe weather today. That stable easterly flow, that cooler air coming in off the ocean. The winds will be about 10 to 20 this afternoon. Our weather and health check today, pollen levels are low, mold spores are moderate, air quality is good, and the UV index is low, of course, due to all of the clouds and rain. On our Storm Team Live Radar Network here, bigger picture shows that we have some heavier rain out to the west. There is a front here, an area of low pressure, which will slide by to our south. And then we watch the upper level part of the system, which is coming into the Midwest now. Yeah, that's some snow back there. Those folks are getting some snow this morning. We will only see a flake or two of the action there, but I do expect scattered showers on Thursday and Friday as that upper level low moves overhead. Severe weather risk today is well to our south. You see that slight risk in the yellow, especially through the mid-Atlantic and down into the southeast. So those folks get into the warm sector of air, the unstable air there south of the warm front. For us, we stay north of the warm front and we see periods of rain throughout the day, which could be heavy at times. You might hear a rumble of thunder. For tonight, notice that we dry out. Tomorrow, starting out on a dry note, uh, but not for long. There's those scattered showers tomorrow afternoon as this upper level system swings through. Now it stays off to our east on Friday. I still think there's a chance for a few showers, maybe a wet snowflake mixed in, but that's not going to slow you down. Friday temperatures will be near 50, but with the wind, it's going to feel a lot colder. So on top of what you already got, and most of you picked up two to three inches of rain, we could see another inch of rain to about two inches in the Susquehanna Valley today. So there's a look at your 10 day forecast. Watch for flooding today into tonight. Tomorrow and Friday scattered showers and improving conditions this weekend and beyond.